when, I'm, when the Lord has taken the major prophet of God into the realm of the spirit to begin to show me some deep things in the realm of the spirit, sometimes I look at it, I look at it and I conceal it for myself and then leave it for myself and then try to find a way to begin to pray about it. But the Lord said, you must always say it. Because the purpose of saying it out is for all the intercessors. Because I know that whenever I come online, I am not the only prophetic individual that is online on Possibility TV. There are people there. I am seeing you all. Prophet, I'm seeing you all. Pastors, I'm seeing you a lot of people that are online. Your duty is to pray. When the Lord has revealed anything, your own duty is to join the major prophet of God. Let us pray about that very issue. Because when we begin to pray about the matters and begin to look at the spirit of world to do what we need to do as human then victory begin to come like the country nigeria when the lord began to show the major prophet of god the, the domestic issues and things that are going to happen when i told you i said get yourself ready because the price of petroleum is going to hit a thousand and above today even without confirming the prophecy many of you heard when the prophecy was coming from last year from cross overnight and all of that the price of, uh, of, of food stuff, like the rice, price of rice, in some places, somebody sent me a message from Port Harcourt. He said, man of God, I said, yes. He said, when you get the prophecy, people should get rice. I went and bought rice at 60 something. Right now, man of God, in Port Harcourt, bag of rice is sold at 100,000. I said, that is the prophecy that I gave here, and I told you to go and get it for yourself because of what is ahead. He said, man of God, I thank you because of that message because it helped me. I have to use some money in my hand to get those bags of rice there in the house. Prakato Shala Faradin is God. We are, there is counsel that is safety. In the multitude of counsel, that is safety. For God to so much love the world and begin to give us revelations of things, God is trying to make sure that we are not unaware God doesn't want his children to be caught unaware because everything that is going to happen under the sun, God is aware of them all. <laughs> oh, glory to this God. God is aware of them all. All that will happen under the sun, all that will happen in the universe, whatever is going to be anywhere, any place, God is aware of them. And this is why I told Nigeria some few weeks ago they should pray and they should work hard about what I am seeing like, like a flood, like the erosion, but this is a flood that will come like a joke and begin to sweep people out of their house. I told Nigeria to do something about that and they thought it was a joke until the flood came. And right now they thought they have already arrested. But in the realm of the spirit, I am 16, what's called another dangerous floor that, that is going to make a lot of people to pack out of their state and find themselves another place that's going to carry houses and so many things like that. Nigerian government and the people authority involved should begin to do something quickly. They should take, take the cloud as quick as possible and do something and stand on their feet because the Lord is saying that this very matter about this floor that I begin to see in the realm of the spirit is something that is already spiritually is something that is tabletted, that has remedy because there's going to be another floor in Nigeria. That's going to make a lot of people to be on their heels and begin to run a task And some people be in the houses and the floor comes and take over the house. This is an issue that needs to be taken very urgent. This is an issue. This is an issue that people need to wake up. And the people that are into what's called this, this was called people who are into flood management should quickly really wake up from their slumber. Get boats ready. Get, get, get what's called this was called boats. Get it ready. Get some mini ships and get so many flying jets and flying objects and things that are going to be used to rescue people. Because this is what is, this was called this is an issue that is already in the realm of the spirit that's going to hit the Nigeria as quick as possible. Because the eyes of the Lord will always go spiritual to see everything spiritually of course before they begin to happen in the realm of the physical. Please share the broadcast and do us a favor. Do us a favor and share the broadcast as quick as possible so everybody can be able to now begin to hear this very prophecy and also do what they need to do and begin to pray the prayer they need to pray. Don't forget that prayer is a very strong instrument that we can use to stop the devil. And don't say it doesn't concern me. If major prophet of God, after I have seen it and I keep quiet, say it doesn't concern me. 
If anything begins to happen there, the Lord will say, I showed you this. Why didn't you raise an alarm? So major prophet is raising an alarm. So everybody needs to do what they need to do because this is what's called another flood that is going to come in a dangerous thick way. And somebody would not say, oh, a flood, he saw the flood before and he came and seen it again. I, I'm not just seeing. This is, this is what's called a major prophet of God, a blessing to the world and a blessing to Africa, blessing to even this part of the world where I am that neglected the work of God and neglect what's called the gift of God for them. So they should do something as quick as possible because this was all in the realm of the spirit. This was all another dangerous flood coming to Nigeria. Nigeria should do something as quick as possible. If 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 weather forecast can be able to forecast and tell people things in three four days that will happen or in a week. How much more God that made the heavens and the earth? That is why God will give you something that will happen a year before it begins to happen and begin to turn you more and step into the week and begin to also give you the message the way they are spiritually designed so that people who need to understand the voice of God and need to know what God is saying can be able to know them because they are spiritually designed. Everything that is spiritually designed is designed for people who are also spiritual to be able to compare spiritual to spiritual. For what's called deep, call it unto the deep. So wherever you are and you're watching me this evening, pray for Nigeria against what's called, this was called fraud coming to Nigeria in a brutal way and in a more, more dangerous way. You must pray against this and let the Lord be glorified let the lord take control and let the lord silence the plans of the enemy because there are a lot of spiritual conspiracy in nigeria in the realm of the spirit i am seeing what's called a lot of cries and this cry i am looking at the spiritual realm i'm seeing what's called a blood of innocent people crying every day by day and this is the reason why some of them on the floor on the ground wants to be washed away and this issue has become an issue that begins to now cause what's called this was called some kind of disasters must pray against these pray against these pray against these because nothing will happen except the Lord has revealed nothing can happen on the face of the earth except the Lord has revealed and if you did not find it or, or something that to give God glory or to say thank you God Almighty for what you are doing if you are not seeing it as intriguing I want you to know that no human being can know all of this except it's revealed to him by God. Except it's revealed to him by God. So Nigeria needs to do something as quick as possible. Our prayer and the reason why God is not taking us in, the, in this high level of prophetic grace to see it all and say it all and prophesy it all is for the blessing of the land. God wants the land to walk out of their problem. The will of God is for the land to be saved. When I'm giving you promise, I say, what are the price of food items are going to go very up? I told you month of September. We are in month of September now. I guess that bag of rice cannot be less than 90,000 now. If you want to buy correct foreign rice, good one, untampered and untouched, you should be talking about 90,000 naira. You should be talking about 90,000. In some states, it's 95. Some places, it's 100,000. People who bought recently, you can comment the price so that we can see the price. If you know, you know about the price of rice. For example, people that buy basmatic or people that buy what's called this was called uh, all those uh, good rice. Can you give us the price that you bought or the price they're selling now so we can know? Because there's what's called another deeper message about what is going to begin to unfold from this very ending of this month into next month. A very deeper message that God will not keep you ignorant. I know that God will not keep you mute. God will not keep you unaware. God will not allow you to be unaware. So comment quickly wherever you're watching me. Comment quickly the price of rice now. If you know the current price of rice, please quickly begin to comment the current price because something is coming that the Lord said, Major Prophet, my servant, go out there and tell your people for those who are following you to be able to now, now begin to now in the realm of the physical to now begin to know the way forward and begin to look at what they can do and the way forward. If you know the 
last price you bought for a price of rice the last price you bought rice bag of rice please help us as quick as possible comment the price or you are selling or you know how much they sell in the state maybe lagos or renugu anambra portacourt anywhere that you know give us the price on uh, on, on the on the comment below because everything that god oh somebody said 92,000. my god that 92,000 is it lagos or is abuja or is it port court where is it where is it where is it where is it because in the realm of the spirit the lord has taken the major prophet of god to now begin to look at what is about to start have mercy upon us, O Lord. 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 Have mercy upon us. Have mercy upon us. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have mercy upon us. Have mercy upon us. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Amen. 